A NASA spacecraft is saying farewell to an asteroid and beginning its long journey to bring back samples to Earth. For nearly five years, we've been following NASA's OSIRIS-REx. It first launched from our coast in September of 2016. In December of 2018, it reached the asteroid Bennu. Now the spacecraft is coming back home. New 6's James Barvero has an update on the journey back. We brought you the launch back in September of 2016, and now all this time later, NASA says its mission to an asteroid and its first ever asteroid sample return is finally ready to voyage home. And we're bringing the samples home. 291 million miles from home, NASA says the OSIRIS-REx spacecraft leaves the asteroid Bennu, carrying primitive rocks and dust the teams believe could teach the agency about how the solar system began and evolved leading to life on Earth. We're really pushing the envelope with our 21st century uh, navigation and operations capabilities to fly a mission like OSIRIS-REx. And liftoff of OSIRIS-REx. An Atlas V rocket launched the seven-year mission from the Cape, and OSIRIS-REx landed on the asteroid last year. NASA says Bennu is only the size of a skyscraper, making it the smallest body in space ever landed on. This is really kind of bittersweet. We've spent over two years at asteroid Bennu, really getting to know it. Uh, but the prime goal of this mission is to bring that sample home. And although during the process some of the sample escaped capture, NASA says the collection well exceeded its minimum target. OSIRIS-REx is expected to land in the Utah desert in September 2023. The samples will be taken to Johnson Space Center in Houston. On the Space Coast, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.